Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to an Nictoy World. Today I would like to show you a Diamond Select uh, DC Gallery. Uh, this is different than you know my normal model, but this is a DC uh, Ocean Master from Aquaman. So uh, it's a typical you know Diamond Galleries um, series. They came in a window box like this, and uh, I think pretty nice. You know, I mean. Uh, for people like a main collector, they can keep this box and uh, get display them like, like this. Okay, but uh, today I'm gonna open this and then show you a uh, the the figure or the statue inside and go through some of the uh, details around you know uh, the paint job, the scope, and uh, the quality and the value of this. Okay, um, so here's what it look like. I mean, he looked pretty big from the box um, and very nice. So uh, let's start open this thing out. Um, so they came in. So just remove the tape from here, from here, and able to check. Uh, you know, they're no, they're not really a set for this at all. It's um, just a matter of uh, you know theory in play. So start open this. Oh, more tapes. Man, they secure the figure so well. Sometimes it's too well. Alright, look at this. Ah. Let's see. Okay. Alright. Uh, cut this. Cut this. So here we go. So this is Aquaman. Not Aquaman Ocean Master. Alright, so how to connect it? Ah, alright. So we're gonna put it in like this and, and plug this thing in. Okay, like this. Okay, we can. I don't know, we can. Okay. So, wow, look pretty cool. And he's staying on top of. I don't know, they look like a statue or something of another person. But uh, this thing looks pretty well done. My god, man, look very nice. Action pole here. Um, you can see here, okay? And I, I can tell the face whether it look uh, because it's not, you know, that maybe there, there it is. You know, you look like uh, in the movie Aquaman, so uh, pretty cool. A lot of texture here, the scale, and all the scale right here. Um, this one look really nice. Okay, closer look. All right, so I'm going to uh, have a, some closer shot of uh, the figure and go through some other, you can, so you can see the paint job and the detail of this figure. All right. Hey guys, uh, before I uh, let you go, we want to see the side comparison. This is Thanos uh, from Diamond Select, and then a, um, Ocean Master on your left, and you see the side pretty comparable here. I mean, Thanos maybe a little bit small compared to his actual scale but you know you can see him a pretty pretty big all right so here it is this okay guys so here it is uh, the aqua uh, aquaman um, ocean master okay and you can see that you know the detail on of these things are pretty good the paint job i think the paint job is not great but okay I see some still seem smear around here and there, but otherwise it looks pretty good. And like I said before, it stand on on these um, some kind of statue, and and you can see here the scale on the shoe, um, and hit it back. So people, a lot of people complain about this particular paint job area right here. Um, yeah, I can see. I mean, it it not uh, perfect, but it look pretty good so far. All right. Um, all right. Very, very nice. I mean, in terms of value, it costs you around, I think maybe 40 bucks or something from Amazon. And I think this, this figure definitely worth it. It's pretty good. Um, it's probably gonna stand along with um, Aquaman very well. And uh, pretty big too. This is a nice, um, in a nine inch scale, so you expect that this figure is bigger than normal. I like the cape on the back right here. Um, it looks uh, pretty in action, right? Um, and it can hurt plastic and very smooth. 
uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, you can see his face here um, again. I really like the um, the scope of the uh, right here. I think the, the detail is pretty sharp. Um, I don't know if you can see it here, but it's pretty sharp. You can see that the texture kind of you know like a fish scale, and and you can feel it with your hand and quite good. Okay. Um, okay. All right, guys. So here it is, Ocean Master uh, from Aquaman. And um, I think this this figure that definitely uh, worth it. A I think the scope is pretty good, nice and uh, action pole. The paint job is pretty good. I mean there may be a little smear here and there, but but you you wouldn't notice that much here. Um, and I think it's pretty much well done. Um, and this is uh, my first time having DC's uh, uh, figure in my collection. The reason why I pick him because you know he kind of look cool. Um, and usually I stay with Marvel more, but but in this time I actually uh, get the uh, the DC from here. And you can see here, um, man, in the action pole. One thing that I uh, noticed that this uh, silver down here a little bit more shinier than the one up here. I'm not sure what the reason behind it. So it look like maybe a little bit uh, battle damage or or dirt or something like that to simulate that this is kind of old and then this is kind of new shoe thing. And and yeah, I mean even the back look pretty good. All right, guys. So uh, I think that it for today. I will put a link below for where you can get it uh, from Amazon. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe for more video. And please thank you for watching. Bye bye.